Hello, this is Ivo from my show, and we're playing Sonic Battle. Well, we're at the beach. Hi, sugar. And here we find Rude, so, you and all that. Did you know what Dino means? Dino you know means, that means, the opposite of Nocturne. Who's her boss? I can find out that right in the game. Why does Rouge just team up with Sonic? It's a bit random. And here we have a battle with Rouge. Fly, so that's that much helpful in fight. I don't think Sega did a good job on the music as he did with Sonic Advance games in this game. I don't think music from Sonic Advance is like really catchy. I feel like how you can heal yourself during the fight though, that seems to be unique for a fighting game. Why is she glowing? If, I, if anyone knows why Rouge is glowing, just leave a comment. Because I honestly do not know why. Or how it affects her in the fight. What is that? It's just... Some of the, some of the characters' special attacks just for, seem to be put in there just to be put in there. And when I hit that, that just fills up my energy. Sweet. Well, I'm calling it the energy. Right? And now, and now we have to battle Rouge, Rouge again. What, what was the point of the first battle? And now, and now she's not hurt at all. If you let Rude hit you into the air, she can take almost all of your health with her, with her attack in the air. Again, that voice creeps me out. And the end is blowing. It's fantastic. And see what I mean about her attack in the air. That attack just killed me. I don't know why the screen just went black. Black. And I luckily just got out of being hit to the ground and having almost all my health taken away. I don't see much strategy to this game's fighting style. I'm sure there is, but right now in the game, it just seems to be like. Just run, run, beat, attack a lot, then run away, then heal, attack a lot, then heal. I don't know what to talk about. Yeah. Yep, so I just see Rouge. Oh, I, yeah, she doesn't want to fight again. Why, why is she saying bye in it? Why is she 
sexy by and the voice is high. It's a bit contradictory. So, you accept- so this time you actually have to go to Tail's lab, not Tail's house. I made that mistake already once. And here we find a gray a Merle. It's not actually a Merle, but it looks exactly like a Merle. So, we're just fighting it for no real reason. So, in this friend, at first in this fight, I thought that it was just like when a Merle was fighting with Shadow. The Merle didn't do a thing. But, yeah. You'll watch. I, I, I'm just like, beating up on the robot and not really showing it much mercy. See, it, you'll see later on it actually attacks and it has like Sonic's moves. But right now it isn't doing much at all. I know. It's, yeah. See, it, it actually, it's actually trying to do something. Like, you know, And there's that voice again. There's that creepy voice again. I actually like this music. The music for the stage a, a lot. Better than I like it better than the beat. And you, you you see that the robot is just trying to attack me now. When the fight's almost over. And the robot can swing dash. And the fight is almost over. Game set. Sweet. So. I don't see why I just added that cutscene. Why does Tails look mad? It makes me think like Tails didn't want to beat up the robot. Take a murder. And now Tails is sad. And now he's happy again. And we'll see what Tails 